now since you saw my face, I haven't been doing so great, so I took a little break. So a lot of people are saying some things about me that aren't quite true. Doesn't matter if it's true though, just as long as it's entertaining to you. Right? You guys having fun? All aboard the toxic gossip train. You're chugging down the tracks of this information. The toxic gossip train. You got a one way ticket to manipulation station. Toxic gossip train. Tie me to the tracks and harass me for my past. Cause rumors look like facts. If you don't mind the gaps, I won't survive in the crash. But hey. At least you're having fun. Uh, hi everyone. I've been wanting to come online and talk to you about a few things. Um, even though my team has strongly advised me to not say what I want to say, I recently realized that they never said that I couldn't sing what I want to say. So, here I am. And um, today I only want to talk about the facts. So, I hope that you'll be willing to listen. Here we go. Many years ago, I used to message my fans, uh, but not in a creepy way, like a lot of you are trying to suggest. It was more of a loser kind of way, where I was just trying to be besties with everybody. It's kind of like uh, when you go to like a family gathering, you know, and there's a weird aunt there who keeps coming up to you and going like, hey girl, what's the tea? And you're like, Ugh. Um, That was me, but in group chats with my fans. It was weird. I've been sharing my life online for over 15 years. I've poured my heart out to you, and because of that, I feel like I'm talking to my friends. But in the beginning of my career, I didn't really understand that maybe there should be some boundaries there. There were times in the DMs when I would overshare details of my life, which was really weird of me. I haven't done that for years, you see, because I changed my behavior and I took accountability. But that's not very interesting, is it? So let's go on the toxic gossip train. The locomotive's fueled with hateful accusations The toxic gossip train Steamroll over someone's reputation Toxic gossip train Hop on board but close your eyes Otherwise you'll realize That the train is made of lies And that person you despise Maybe didn't deserve to die But hey, at least you're having fun in all seriousness, I do think it's really important to hold people accountable for their mistakes. Um, you know, we should hope that everyone can learn from their mistakes and grow and change their behavior and be a better person. And this is something that I've always tried to do when I make mistakes, and it's something that I will continue to try to do. What? Oh, you okay?